I often get requests on how to use a Falcon and actually how to use um, modern SD and CF cards for a, a hard drive in the Atari Falcon. So I guess the best one to kick off with is the installation of a GoTech drive in the Atari Falcon. Um, next to it I have a stock one, I guess you could say, with the 1.44 megabyte a floppy drive in it but this one here I'm going to put a GoTech drive with the HXC firmware installed on it. There's nothing particularly fancy about this drive here. Uh, basically I've installed an OLED display in there keeping the um, 0.91 inch uh, display um, intact and I've also installed a, a piezo buzzer there to um, give the impression that uh, disk activity is taking place. So other than um, the fact that this one is running the HXC firmware, this will equally work with the uh, current flash floppy uh, firmware that's available as well as of October 2018. Okay, obviously with the 1.44 megabyte drive removed, uh, we have the unconnected floppy drive connector and the power lead exposed. Uh, you can just make it out there on the right hand side of the floppy drive connector cable you can see a number two so obviously this side and it's also indicated by the red dotted um, wire there that that will be pin one so obviously, obviously we need to align this one with pin one on the GoTech. People who have installed a GoTech drive in the Mega ST or the ST series of computers will note that the cable often needs a twist. Uh, in this case, Atari has built it so the pin 1 is towards the back of the case, and luckily that's how it aligns with the uh, GoTech drive, so there's no twist required in this case. Now, with the power connected as well, we'll power it up. can see there the Falcon has booted and it's starting up the HXC floppy emulator file so select the image I'll quickly choose a utility for the Falcon let's go with the language disk You can see I've been in here before, but let's put it in slot one as well. Reboot. Some drive activity. And you can see that we're now loading up the language disk. We'll need to do something about that resolution, I think. And there we have it. So now opening up um, A drive, you can see the drive contents here. Fairly straightforward process, probably in some respects much easier than the uh, installation process for the uh, ST series of computers. I guess I need to point out 
that stock uh, GoTech drives have fairly small holes there for mounting the drive inside the case. You, you'll need to widen those sli slightly. So um, this pin here is fine, but the screw that comes in here through the, um, the little pillar there um, is bigger than the, the holes, so they need to be widened first. I guess in my next video, once uh, this floppy drive is uh, properly mounted, we'll look at installing a SD or CF card in, in the Falcon as well.